2.42, I'm in Phuket, Thailand. Let's get into the next video. I'm supposed to be leaving today, but I've not done anything here. So I'm not, I've booked another two nights in a hotel, different hotel, so I'm gonna move. I'm here at Paradise Grows, which is the only breakfast spot that I could find that didn't look, let's say, disgusting. No, <laughs> no, honestly, a lot of them do look really, really nice. This one just looked the best. So I'm gonna go here, have some scran, and I'm heading up to the Big Buddha, which I know I've seen a Big Buddha before on this channel, but this is a new one. Also, it's just the highest point in Phuket, so apparently you get to see over all of Phuket. So I thought I've got up nice and early for a trek out here for the day, do you know what I mean? Take your time, boy, me. Oh yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I've, um, it should be a longer vlog today because I've actually got up and got my finger out my arse. Uh, before nine o'clock, which is strange for me. So all I can say, Danny's let's go <laughs> straight into this. Bed. Well, I've made it to the top, and listen, this wizard barely got it up the hill, mate. Seriously, I thought I was gonna have to get off and start pushing it. It was, it was touch and go at some points there, touching cloth. Jesus. Anyway, I'm here now at the Big Buddha. I can't Google anything because I've left my phone in the hotel room like an idiot. So, how old is it? Don't know. Um, what is it? Don't know. I assume it's just the Lady Buddha again. We'll add on up in a minute. I'm self a smoke. I don't want to smoke in a temple. I don't know what the rules are, but see what I mean? Respectful Mastag is here again. <laughs> Show us your right, So walking up, before you get to uh, the big statue, there's a few questionable looking statues. I'm not sure what it is, what it's for. I'm not sure who they are. As we've said before, this isn't a history channel or a geography channel or a religious channel. This is a channel all about doing dr drinking. <laughs> no, seriously though, it's bloody hot today. I can't do a temperature check because I don't have my phone on me. But, do you know what I mean? I thought it'd be nice to start the day with something meaningful and then we can go derogatory after that and all downhill from there, can't we, Danny boy? Oh, I can see it coming. Can you see her? But uh, it's also the views, mate. We'll start with the views and I'll show you the statue done. I mean, you can see the statue already. <laughs> Have a look at that, Danny boy. Wow. Holy. I'm not sure where the PP islands are. I don't think they're this side. I don't think they are this side. Wow, seriously, look at that. Tell you what, mate, shit's all over the Peak District, Dan. Oi. Bloody hell, mate. Honestly, it's so hot. Thought of climbing them stairs is making me sweat already, Dan. Should I just enjoy it from down here? <laughs> oh. oh, it must be 35 today. It's an absolute scorcher, Dan. Come on, we don't stop on this channel, do we? No days off. No moaning. <laughs> There's plenty of moaning. <laughs> oh, I'm supposed to take my shoes off. Right, like I say, I've looked at all the stuff to do today in Phuket, and to be honest, I think it is a very much come and hang out on the beach vibes. I think all of South Thailand is going to be like that, Phuket, Phi Phi, and Krabi as well. So, ah, I took my shoes off and there's loads of stones on the floor. But we'll see. We'll figure it out, Dan. I mean, I'm not whinging at the moment and sitting chilling on the beach, but it's just hard to make content without just getting pissed. <laughs> Almost there, Danny boy. Look at that. This is what it looks like inside. Not much to show you, Dan. Like I could say, pretty impressive to be honest with you, but it doesn't do anything, does it? So <laughs> imagine it starts moving, Dan. Oh, you could do um, Zagaya doing meditation. You could do seven minutes of meditation. I'm not much of a meditating guy. I'm. Um, ah, maybe I should meditate. <laughs> Get all of this pent up anger out of me. Oh, I'm just coming up now. Something, I'm not actually sure what I'm going up for. We'll soon figure it out then. Don't know. Maybe it's the view of this power line. Okay, no, it says, do not feed or catch the monkeys they bite. So apparently there's monkeys. I think it's just a viewpoint though, to be honest. Oh, I want to see a monkey now. Have a look. Oh, there's one. Sick. Right, someone's playing this drum and it does not sound like you'd expect it to sound. I thought it'd just be a good doing. <laughs> this 
mad how different it sounds on that side than it does on this side. I wanted to do it, but I thought, oh, it'd be disrespectful. I was just gonna literally walk up and go, boing. <laughs> Turns out, no, you actually play like a proper instrument. Right, I've got to go, it's too hot. I need to go back to the hotel, get my phone reset, and then we're going back out on the Raz. No, maybe, I don't know, probably. <laughs> As I'm leaving, I've realized I've basically run out of petrol, but luckily there's a petrol station here. <laughs> Look at this, mate. Crazy. Hello, uh, 91 I need. Thank you. Mental. <laughs> Imagine they did this in the UK, mate. It'd be a bloody nightmare. Look at that. Really good service, isn't it? <laughs> also, check this. On the way back, you get to drive past elephants. I did see them on the way. But I couldn't stop in time. Oh. Boy, these roads are a bit windy, so let me drive back. Oh, it's so hot today. Let's do a temperature check since I'm not on my phone all day. Hey Siri, what is the temperature? It's about 32 degrees outside. 32 degrees? Why does it feel like 50? <laughs> it's a scorcher today, Dan. This is proper hot, mate. I literally even got a bit burnt yesterday. I had to put aloe vera gel on my head. And here we are, welcome to the hustle and the bustle of Phuket Town, Danny boy. I just want to get an ice cream, that's what I'm craving, bro. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna race this old lady, but she doesn't even know it. She's about to get smoked, mate. Here we go, green. Light work, mate. <laughs> Obviously it's nice driving in these countries, yeah, but then when you come to the red light, the red lights, some of them go for like 250 seconds. Look at this. <laughs> some of them go for like 250 seconds, bro. And when you stood here, this is when you stop burning. It's properly like, <laughs> it's like being in a sauna, but outside and all the time and it never stops. Oh shit. This is stupid hot mate. Ask and you shall receive, Danny boy. What have I just driven past? An ice cream parlor. Saudi crab. Hello. Ooh. Oh, banana can banana pancake, please. Uh, waffle cone, please, sweetie. Thank you very much. Okay, she's low-key bumped me, right? <laughs> You know when you buy an ice cream cone, you expect them to fill the cone. She's literally just put one scoop on top. Bit of a black. And um, bought the cost 79 bars, about £1.50. Let's test it out. <laughs> that tastes fire, bro. I won't whinge about it. I know I love a moan. <laughs> oh, that's absolutely smart. That it just tastes like banana pancakes. Okay, it's come to the revelation, resolution. I don't know what the word is. Apparently, Bangalore Road in Pratong in Phuket you can actually buy the Kraton potions the real deal ones yeah not the um the ones that fat bloke from TikTok this is the proper stuff mate so I'm gonna head on down and we're gonna try one mate because <laughs> I love trying new things especially if it apparently gives me a buzz <laughs> I don't know what the legality around here is I'm pretty sure they're legal we're gonna tell everybody they're legal they're legal it's fine don't worry about it <laughs> To race a Ferrari. Smoked him. <laughs> There's no point having a Ferrari in places like this, mate. Seriously. Other than it looking cool, yeah? And you probably get better birds with it. Yeah, it's worth having. <laughs> but yeah, there's not like utility behind it. You can't really use it too well. You're definitely better off on a bike, which is why everybody rides bikes, Dad. So we've ditched the trusty whiz up. We are on. The two, like two streets away from Bangla Road, which is like I say, I don't know if I mentioned it, it's like the Kosan Road of Phuket. So obviously everything in and around here, I'm okay with it. Everything in and around here is your all your, your gun shops, your restaurants, your fake Gucci shops, your tour guides, everything that's set up for tourists. Here we are, Danny boy. Tong Beach, Phuket, Thailand, Bangla Road. Let's, let's get straight into this bitch then, Danny boy. Oh. Hello, brother. What's up? Oh. Ah, look, sounds dangerous. Is that guns? Guns. Bloody guns kill people, mate. 
No, I'm only joking. I'm okay, brother. Thank you, though. <coughs> I'm okay. What? Coke? Yeah. What, Coca-Cola? Coca-Cola? The drink? Yeah. No. Oh, what? What's that move? Sniffing? Yeah. Drugs? Bloody hell, I'm, I'm a police officer. You're under arrest. You're under arrest. <laughs> yeah, no bad. Also, have you noticed this? The electricity wires that they've got going on all around Thailand is absolutely insane. Like, seriously, they tell you at home, oh, don't plug an extension cord in, it'll blow up, it'll set on fire. Bollocks. If these men can do this, I'm pretty sure I can put three plugs into one, do you know what I mean? Chill out. <laughs> I'm not sure what sort of shop is going to sell the potions. Whether I need to buy it from a boozer, a weed shop, or if there's just going to be a random Thai lady on the side of the street with some dirty looking water bottles. <laughs> Either way, let's go and have a look. I really can't see it. I did just Google um, Kratom. Also, it is legal, completely legal. So I can't find any on this road, but I've Googled it and there's a place 0.4 miles away. So I'm going to drive there and I'll get it from there. And we have arrived at Karen's, what is it? Natalie's Cannabis and Kratom Bar. Hello, good morning. Salut, Karab. I'm wanting a, a, a potion, Kratom potion. I'm powder. Powder? The drink? Okay. One bottle. One bottle, please, yes. Okay, so it's only costing one pound fifty, not one pound fifty. One fifty, which is about three quid. So, can't be that strong, can it, if it's three quid? <laughs> That's my logic, anyway. There's lots of broccoli options here, and some of it looks very good, but we're not here for broccoli, we're here for this river water. And when I say river water, when you see it, you'll say, yeah, okay, it looks like river water. <laughs> Cup and crab. Thank you. Okay, right, let's go to the beach, I suppose, and drink this stuff. And here it is. One bottle of river water. Looks delicious, doesn't it? Right, let's sip it off and see what happens, Dan. <laughs> it tastes exactly how it looks, like river water. <laughs> oh, God, I don't know if I can even drink that. Oh, that's so bad. That's so awful. That's so disgusting. That's the worst drink I've ever had. But it cost me three quid, so I'm going to finish it. Ah, <laughs> oh, that is truly, truly awful and horrible. I like your tattoos, brother. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, come here. Come here. Where, where, where you from? Where you from? England. Yeah. Come here. I want to. I want to show my friends your tattoo. He's got a big ganja leaf tied on his face. Hey, oh yeah, come here. I like your tattoos, brother. Okay. Very cool. Okay, <laughs> welcome to Thailand. Yeah, really welcome good. Welcome to Thailand, yeah. brother. Patong Miss, yeah. Patong Miss, I like yeah, this. Yeah, Patong Miss. Sick. Yeah. <laughs> You're crazy. Yeah, man, you like weed then, yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you must always be high, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Back to it then, I suppose. <sighs> Oh god. Ah, I'll come back with the results. Yeah. What is it? Whiskey? Yeah. Oh god. Really strong. Cheers, brother. Yeah. 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 Cool. Oh, oh. <laughs> Very strong. What's your name? M. M? Yeah. Max, nice to meet you. No opening door. Oh. Did you make that yourself? Yeah. Yeah. You know, it tastes like it. How you there? Sorry? Mm. Yeah, oh yeah. You know, I'm hanging out with the, uh, the beach boys. <laughs> so what I should have done really is look into this. <laughs> so some side effects known from drinking Kratom. Euphoria, I'm happy with that. Sedation, not so much. Dizziness, sounds good. Tongue numbness, shit. <laughs> Nausea and vomiting, normal. Dry mouth, okay. Need to urinate frequently, that's odd. Constipation, mate. Poo falls out my ass at a very, very high speed, four or five times a day. I'm not worried about that one. Stomach pain. Oh, hallucinations. That sounds like a fun one, doesn't it? <laughs> Delusions. I'm delusional already, mate. <laughs> thyroid problems. Not quite sure what a thyroid is, but I'm hoping not to have any problems with mine. Difficulties breathing. That sounds like a good one. <laughs> Brain swelling. Brain swelling. The swelling of the brain. Why have I just drank this? Seizures and liver damage. 
Oh, thanks, Tom Bertie. Thanks for making me think Tom was a good idea. <laughs> all right, it can't be that bad, innit, if we're all drinking it. Although loads of people do heroin, uh, and that's quite bad, so. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, we're here now. Come along for the ride. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Right, it's been about 10 minutes. I've still not felt anything right, but I've just bumped into these two Welsh lads and they've never had it, so he's going to try a sip. He's just had a sip and he, oh, he yeah. says it was horrible. Oh. <laughs> Leave it, that tastes oh. right, mate. <laughs> oh, it is That's actually gash, terrible. mate. Wait, what's the time? Oh. 32, so it's been 20 minutes. I'm not like that. I don't know, I don't think I've felt any actual effect. Other than maybe I don't feel as, I don't know. <laughs> I was expecting it to be like a fucking line of whiff, do you know what I mean? Like I'm gonna fucking be like, yeah, fucking yeah, like yeah. proper like, yeah, I need yeah, another one, give another one, but I don't know. So, so far I'd give this nothing, a nothing out of 10. And these lads, have, uh, they're going on the jet skis and they said, why don't you come on? And I was like, why don't I come on? We're gonna, I'm gonna learn my lesson from last time and take a little video from the outside but I'm gonna make sure that these guys stay at least 50 <laughs> meters away from me so we all know there's no chance that I have actually hit anything. Three jet skis, brother. Three jet skis. A special prize for three. Three, three, the, three of the million ones, 5,000. Yes. Yeah? Yes. I mean 4,000. 5,000. Shit. <laughs> he said 5,000 yes too quick, didn't he? Okay, yeah, okay, 5,000, 5,000. Right, there's another man now that wants in, so we're, got, we're gonna renegotiate our deal, man. Six, six K, six K for four. You, you okay? I'm not okay, right? Hey, good for you, good for me, mate. You give me six thousand, right? Okay, can you? I can give you the time, like I just twenty-seven minutes, twenty-eight minutes. If you give me the like a six, six five or seven, I give you forty minutes or maybe thirty-five minutes. You want? I mean, I'm happy with 28 minutes. <laughs> yeah, we're not two minutes off then, that's sad. But it feels like I've drank two, two energy drinks, two monsters, and it just makes you feel a bit sick. So hopefully it doesn't get any worse than this. I can cope with this, but don't fancy actually puking on a jet ski, Dan. Right, as we can all see, Oh, go on, Dan. There's no damage. We've all taken videos. It's going to be okay. I'm really going to make sure there's no way that I hit anything. I'm not even going to go near anybody. Oh, it is jellyfish season though, so I don't really don't want to fall in. Let's go, baby! <laughs> okay, apparently that boat over there, apparently that boat over there is a boat party, so we're going to go over and investigate, Danny boy. It is not a boat party, it's a floating beach club. Come and have a look at this. It's an actual beach club that just floats here. I don't know if it's a boat or what, it looks sick. You keep away from me, Dan. Yeah, look at that. I might have to come and spend a day here, Danny boy. Oh, too close. Look at how many jellyfish there is. Big boys. Bro, look how many jellyfish there is. Look at that, mate. Ah, I do not want to fall in. I'm concerned about the water splashing me now. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh, shit. Bro, there's bears. There's so many. Oh, look. There's one there. There's one there. There's one there. There's one there. Oh, what a nightmare. This is my, if I fall in here, I will scream and I will die because I am absolutely shitting it. <laughs> right, let me enjoy the last 10 minutes, Dad, and then we'll get back to the beach. Also, I've got a bit of the dry mouth coming through, but overall, mate, load of shit, mate. I'm getting more of a buzz driving the jet skis than I did off that bloody drink. Look at that. Hello, Great mate. service, darling. Kapunka. Kapunka. Thank you. Right. Cheers, boys. Cheers for that. Oh, and just like that, another day done. Unfortunately, I am gonna have to go and drop the bike back off now, so I thought, let me have a bit of fun with it before we go. AKA, let me break it. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna break it. Call me DK, drift kick. Let's go somewhere where I can actually do a wheelie, because I'm just wheel spinning on this. Pathetic. 
fantastic. They were dreadful. One thing that we can do. Burn out, baby. Anyway, enough of that. I'm going to do some damage in a minute. Hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, comment along for more videos because tomorrow is going to be another day full of adventure and fun. Love you all. Absolutely love you all so much. So thanks for making this come true. Let's get into tomorrow's video. Ugh. Safe.